Welcome everybody. Today we are going to talk about tux paint and specifically about using the paint brushes. Tux paint is an application that allows you to use your computer to draw images. To begin, you need to go down to your dock and you need to search for the penguin, which is called tux paint. When you find it, select it by clicking on it. The software will then open up and it will give you this screen. You have this area right here, which is your canvas where you can draw on. Over here, you have tools. Paint is the one that we're working on and it has a picture of a paintbrush. Down here, you can choose colors. And over here, since you have brushes and we're working with paint, are the different options of brushes that you can use to draw with. There are many different brushes that you can choose from in your, to draw your picture. If you look down at the pink oval at the bottom, there's an arrow, and if you click on it, it will show you more brush options that you have to use in your picture. To begin with, you can tell which tool is selected by which one is the dark blue. You notice that when I select the tools over here, these over here change. So again, we're going to start with the paint and we're going to work with the brushes. So I'm going to begin by starting to draw the ground. So I'm going to select the color brown because that's what dirt is. And I'm going to select a large paint brush. You can tell because it goes to dark blue. Then I'm going to draw in my ground. On top of my ground, I would like to draw a little bit of grass, but I don't want it as thick as this down here, so I'm going to choose a smaller paintbrush to draw my grass. Select the color green. In the upper corner, I want to draw a sun. So I'm going to choose the color yellow, and I'm going to choose a different size paintbrush. Please remember that there are options of different paintbrushes that you can choose on the right hand side of the window. You can select those by clicking on the arrows inside the pink oval. I would like to draw rays on the sun that are very thin, so I'm going to choose the thinnest paintbrush. And then I want to put a face inside of it, so I'm going to choose a thicker brush and a different color. Now, I would like to create a tree right here. So for a tree, I'm going to select the color brown, a different paint brush that I want the stock to be, and I will make my tree. Branches are thinner, so I would use a smaller, thinner brush for the branches. And then I want to add some leaves, so I would choose the color green, a different color. Now there are some unique patterns that are on here too that you may want to use. Um, here's a neat one to add some color inside of the tree. I would then like to draw an animal right here and since it's a fairly, fairly small picture I would like to use a small brush. I'll make it being chased by a large animal. In this case, it's a rhinoceros. I'll add eyes, hooves. And then let's say that I want to add, there's a pond right here. So I could just change the color, make the area, and make a little pond. Add birds by using, again, the small.
And there we have a picture using only the paint, different colors, and selecting different brushes. When you are finished, I would like you to please click the Save button. It will say right here your image has been saved. And then when you are finished, you can click the Quit button. It will ask you if you really want to quit. You will select the check mark, yes. I want to thank you very much for your time. Goodbye.